Hello guys, welcome to my home bar. My name is Lene and today we're gonna make a Bloody Mary. Very easy cocktail to make, let's make one together. Need a small tin. So, vodka base, gonna need 50 ml. Vodka. Here we go. So, you're gonna need Worcester sauce, gonna need 25 ml. There we go. So, I don't need to go for Tabasco, but Tabasco is up to your taste. So every time I go for a guest, ask them for Tabasco, I'll give them the chance to choose from zero to 10, how spicy they want the Tabasco. So, six means medium, 10 means hot, one means zero. So, you know what I mean? I love it quite spicy, so go eight drops of Tabasco. There you go. I'm gonna add 20 ml of lemon juice. Ten ml of gum, just to balance the acidity of the tomato, and I've got this tomato juice. It's one twenty-five ml of tomato. Okay, a little dash of black pepper and a pinch of salt. So, with the Bloody Mary, there's a, a couple of techniques. So, there's a rolling and a throwing. So, you don't want to shake a Bloody Mary, and that's going to get too much dilution, too much aeration to it. So, we're going to throw it today. We're going to show you how to roll it as well. So, large tin, and ice cubes. <laughs> that was a fine moment. And a large ice cube for my glass. So for Bloody Marys, you can use a, a large ice cube, cube ice. I use a large one because I want my Bloody Mary to sit for a long time without getting so much dilution to it. So that's why I choose to use a block of ice, but you can use whatever you want, but not a crush ice. Thank you. And here we go. So throwing technique. Put the, the cubes in here, a strainer, and then drop everything straight inside of the glass. And slowly, slowly, you're gonna go upside down. So you're gonna start from the, uh, uh, from the top one and go down in the bottom one. You'll have like a little aeration to the drink, but without getting all this um, dilution. And keep going. We're gonna do about this to, uh, four or five times. So you're gonna read the temperature you're looking for. There you go. And one more try, and voila. So you can go higher, depending on what you wanna do, you can practice on it, but that's what it should be. Everything drop in the glass. And it's this beautiful color. Okay, as a garnish, a little bit of lemon wedge on the side. And here you go, guys. Enjoy your drink.